Jose Rivera's win against Real AM the past weekend. We've seen the likes of Patrick Masangwai and Katleo Otladisa in action, in which after the match, they set a press uh, briefing of uh, Jose Rivera to give the feedback uh, on uh, how he viewed the match and how his players performed. But it seems like he was not happy with a couple of things in the match. He was not uh, happy about the setup of the stadium. But at the later end, Pesega Chablila, Chablila Oguti, Abafana Bawinile. But then he was completely he lashed out at the journalist because he's saying that they always ask him about individuals and he's not about individuals but Funa Ugutibambuze a match entirely Pelawayo without focusing in individuals he was saying that he had 16 players that were not present because of injuries so when he was asked he lashed out again and he told them Muguti no because these players the problem is that they have their personal issues and these are their health and medical doctors are the ones supposed to give them the updates of the individual so it was not his job or his duty just to give them but what he will say he wants to talk about the team effort of how everyone contributed in terms of um getting the four goals in and have this win against the royal am that was uh, joe rivera's weight and it seems like orlando pirates have 16 injuries that is the whole squad overall team young pilaleo yeah bono guti so it means guti orlando pirates is still facing some challenges i don't think uh yeah, coach reveal will get to the squad that he wants uh, if on um, half of he of his trusted men are not at the pitch are having health issues then it means with uh, the pirates will still face uh, another challenges uh, coming uh, this season Orlando Pirates coach Jose Rivero says he had 16 players not available but a true to form will not disclose who is out or what the nature of their injuries are. I give an idea what the expert says in key performances such as Timbinko's lodge back in action. Rivero has made it a controversial policy in his post-match press conferences not to discuss players out through injury and give details on their prognosis. After a 1-0 opening DSTV Premiership defeat to Stellenbosch FC on Saturday, where coach complained of the state of the pitch at Daniel Craven Stadium but said he was happy with the overall performance. He discloses playing squad has more than a dozen players out injured. Bucks meet Royal AM at Orlando Stadium on Tuesday night. We had 16 absences. They are coming, Rivero said. I'm not the one to speak about the health of my players. I am used to saying this in job because this question always comes in at the end of the post-major pre-conference. We deal with 20 fantastic football players who are fit and I think it's better to speak about them. Press on need to inform the public and team supporters on the status of injured players. Rivero refused saying why because you want it. I don't speak about the health of my players. It's not going to change. I'm not allowed to. It's medical information. It's private. He was asked about his new signings who played on Saturday. Patrick Masangani who started as a striker and Katleho Otladisa who replaced him in the 63rd minute of the match. Strike in the end and for the second round, Patrick did well as usual. He was consistent in pre-seasoning, scoring three goals in difficult matches. He is an interesting player, but I'm speaking about individuals now, not that's all press on the issue that the public deserve information the coach continued i was happy with both masangwani and otladisa they are the fresh new players in the group Gateo is also an attractive player to see him play 
football and little by little they are becoming integrated into what we want uh, to as a collective uh, apart from launch uh, nigerian center back or Lissander is another player believed to be pirate injury released there Rivero has disclosed that some of the club signing have arrived in various state of fitness and joined the preseason at the different stages so are not match fit.